Okay, in this video what we want to do is I want to show you how to set up your list if in fact you want to use your list to insert the information from the list into the sender. So what you want to do is use a spreadsheet program something like Microsoft Excel and I'll also show you how to use one that's free if you don't have Excel which is called OpenOffice.org. You can download it there, OpenOffice.org. But if you open up Excel and you go, I'll move this screen over here, you go to File, Open, and then you navigate through your screens here. I'm just finding my files. You navigate through your screens to find the list you want to use. So I'm going over here to find my file, opening up here. Make sure you also select over here to go look at all files. You'll be able to find CSV files, which these are, as well as text files, which these are. So I'm just going to select a small list over here, and it'll open up. Okay. Now, you'll see on the first row here that each one of these columns has the information on the first row, what is in the column. If you want to spread them out, you just go like that, open them up. So you'll be able to see this is the first name, last name, email, address, and so on. That's what you want to have. You have to have that first row to be able to dictate to the mailer what's in each one of the rows so this way it can in insert each one of the bits of information for you. If you don't have that, let's just say that you don't have this. Let me delete that. Maybe you have a list like that. So what you do is you click on the first number one here, highlight it, go up to here, insert row, and there you go. Then you would just type in here, be as simple as possible. Just go first, go over to the next one, last. You don't have to go first name, last name, and so on. Sometimes you can even just go E. I mean, you know that's the email. And um, then uh, address, city, state, you know. So it could be as simple as that because you'll see that information in the mailer and you'll see, oh, I know E is email, A is address, L is last name, F is first name, and so on. So that's the only, you only need that little bit of information to be able to import that, that information, okay? So now what we do is if we close this, I don't need to save it because it already has that information on it. Okay, so you would go over to your mailer and as per the other videos we have, import that information. Now there's another website that you can go to um, that is called OpenOffice and it's OpenOffice.org. That's a free version. It, uh, it's a free software. You would click on here and that software mimics Microsoft Office. It has um, a spreadsheet that they call Spreadsheet, and you'll be able to use that. Just click on here, navigate through their options, select your language, um, download the software, install it into your computer, and then launch it. Then you'll be able to use, a, just like Excel, you use their spreadsheet program and then import the information directly into um, OpenOffice and this way you can manipulate it just like you did or just like I showed you in Microsoft Excel. So it works just like that. It also has a version of Microsoft Works and PowerPoint and so on in there and it's free which is great. Alright, so that shows you how to import. Thanks and have a great day.